If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, stomp your feet. If you're happy and you know it, then your face would... John the Baptist prepares the way. That's our story today. John was an unusual man. He had lots of hair and a long beard. His clothes looked like his face. They too were furry and hairy. His clothes were made of camel's hair, held together with a leather belt. John ate strange foods, including wild honey and locusts. Kind of grasshopper. <laughs> God gave John an important job. His job was to tell people that Jesus was coming and to help them get ready to believe what Jesus would teach them. John knew the things Jesus would teach people were the most important things in the world. When he taught people, John stood by the river and yelled out, Hey, all of you, tell God you're sorry for your sins. Turn your life around and act in ways that are good and honest. Then he would turn to the other group and shout, are you listening? This is important. Jesus is coming. He is the Messiah. He will save all of us. Day after day, John continued teaching, preaching, and crying out so people would listen. Many people came to hear what John had to say about Jesus. They were rich and poor people, honest and dishonest people, nice and not so nice people. Some people listened to John and some people didn't. Some people said, that man must be a messenger from God. Some said, he is really odd. I'm getting out of here. Many people believed the message John told. Those people said, I am so sorry for my sins. I want God to forgive me. To each John said, God does forgive you. He baptized those people in the river. The people started calling him John the Baptist. John the Baptist had done a good job. The people were ready to hear the message. Jesus would bring. That's our story. In today's Bible story, John said, here comes Jesus. During Advent, Christians get ready for Jesus to come too. How? Let's look at the, let's look at the first one. Light an Advent wreath. Today, we will light the second blue candle. John prepared the way for Jesus by telling everyone about him. He yelled and he told people to tell God that they were sorry for what they had done wrong. He would also say, this is important and this is really big. Jesus the Messiah is coming. Even though John lived in the wilderness, God gave him an important job to do. God can use us, whomever we are and wherever we live, to tell others about Jesus. Even if, we have, even if we happen to live outdoors, today, I hope you will tell somebody about Jesus. Will you pray with me? Dear God, thank you for John the Baptist, who baptized with water and told everyone that Jesus was coming. Help us to tell others about Jesus too.